God has an important message for you today. God says it's about someone who has been thinking about you day and night. This person has realized the mistake they made by pursuing the wrong people and now deeply regrets it. They have come to understand your importance in their life and how much they value you. It is natural for us as human beings to make mistakes and sometimes get involved with the wrong things or people. But this person has had a change of heart and now seeks to make amends. Your connection with the angel's consciousness has brought you a celestial message. Subscribe to our channel if you believe that divine consciousness protects and guides you. They are planning to re-enter your life, apologize, and seek another chance to be with you. Forgiveness is a powerful act that allows us to heal and move forward in life. When someone genuinely regrets their actions and seeks forgiveness, it demonstrates courage and humility on their part. It shows that they are willing to take responsibility for their mistakes and are committed to doing the right thing. God urges you to consider giving this person another chance. We all deserve a second chance in life, especially when we genuinely regret the pain we may have caused others. It's not an easy decision to make, but forgiveness can lead to healing and closure for both parties involved. If you choose to forgive this person, it doesn't mean you forget what happened or that everything will be perfect automatically. It takes time and effort to rebuild trust and strengthen the bond between two people, but with genuine remorse and a commitment to change, it is possible to rebuild a stronger relationship than before. However, it's also essential to trust your instincts and listen to your heart. If you feel that forgiving this person and giving them another chance is the right path, then follow that path. But if you have reservations or doubts, take the time to reflect and consider what is best for your well-being and happiness. Remember that forgiveness is not just for the other person, it is also a gift you give to yourself. By forgiving, you release the burden of anger and resentment from your heart, allowing yourself to heal and move forward in life. It is a powerful act of self-love and compassion. Write 222 if you trust in God. Even though this person may be seeking forgiveness now, it is crucial to communicate openly and honestly about your feelings and concerns. Express how their actions have affected you and what you need in the future. Honest communication is the foundation of any healthy relationship. God reminds you that you are a person of worth and value. You deserve to be with someone who respects and appreciates you for who you are. If this person truly understands your worth and is ready to treat you with love and care, then they will work to earn your trust and demonstrate their commitment. On the other hand, if this person is not sincere in their apologies and intentions, you have the strength to let go and move on. Trust that the right person will come into your life at the right time and will value you for the incredible person you are. It is also essential to remember that forgiveness does not mean you have to forget or ignore past actions. Learn from the experience and use it as an opportunity for personal growth and self-awareness. Establish healthy boundaries and ensure that your needs and values are respected in any relationship. God encourages you to be kind and compassionate to yourself during this process. Take the time you need to reflect and make decisions that align with your heart and values. Remember that you deserve love, respect, and happiness. Embrace your uniqueness and value, and don't let anyone or anything make you doubt your worth. Prioritize your well-being and surround yourself with people who appreciate and value you for the wonderful person you are. God's love for you is unconditional, and He wants you to live a life full of joy, love, and fulfillment. Always remember your worth and walk with confidence in the knowledge that you deserve all the good things life has to offer. Get ready to receive. Like this video to claim it before leaving your home. Before you do or say anything else when you wake up in your bed, talk to me from your heart with beautiful words of worship. Don't step out of your door without giving thanks for everything. 
enemies lurk and want you to forget where your blessings come from. So, schedule a morning appointment with me in your busy agenda. Note the time of day when you will kneel and present your family's concerns before my presence. Yes, I love and value each one in your home. Each has a special place in my heart. So, don't give anyone else the place that belongs to me. If you want to see victory, happiness, and strength, you can't overlook my word or ignore my messages. I am planting in your soul the precise instructions so that with faith and confidence, you can easily find the solution to your problems and afflictions. But if you forget this eternal love that longs for you and cares for you, if you allow the wicked to sow doubt and discord in your mind and family, those anxieties and worries will return. You will forget where your salvation comes from. So, pay attention. Entrust your plans to me, commit your ways to me, trust and wait, and I will take care of your problems. I don't promise an easy life, but I will give you strength in every trial. You will be filled with authority, intelligence, and wisdom. You will be greatly blessed, and my powerful light will illuminate your home and family day and night. There will be no darkness or evil that can harm us. Witchcraft and sorcery cannot enslave us. Always remember who saved you. When you face struggles, instead of giving in to fear, these words will grow in you. At the most unexpected moment, you will receive revelation, understand your purpose, and your special and powerful place in the spiritual world. In you is my power to confront the forces of evil, resist your enemies, and make them flee. Listen carefully and believe me. When you read my word, you will receive unknown promises, and you will see what your natural eyes cannot. I love you, and I gave my life for you. I resurrected to give you power. My Holy Spirit will come upon you, and you will feel the need to speak of my love to people. Even those who didn't believe will kneel before me because of the message you will carry. You are in the right moment. It's your time to triumph and fulfill my purpose in you. Your age and location don't matter now. If you believe in my word and faithfulness, you have the faith to move forward without getting distracted and looking ahead. You have a path and destiny written. If I surround you with blessings and gifts, accept them with gratitude. You are already clean from iniquity, and you can come before my throne to present your requests with confidence. Write 1010 to receive it. You have the doors open, there's nothing and no one to stop you. I myself invite you to come in. Many times, you haven't asked for everything you need because you think I won't answer. I'm pleased to respond to you, and I want to manifest my love to you. I want you to see my promises fulfilled with your own eyes and witness marvelous miracles happening around you. It doesn't bother me if you call me in the early morning, I don't sleep or rest. I'm always attentive and watching so that you lack nothing. So come, cry out and I will answer you with beautiful things that you have yet to discover. I want you to focus on your relationship with me. I won't take your time, instead, I will move heaven and earth in your favor. The minutes you dedicate to me will turn into years of life and beautiful times of blessings. I desire your faith to ignite, and this living flame within you will consume all impurity, doubt, and offense, turning them into ashes. The accusations of your enemies will be carried away by the wind into an abyss. Now I want to see your grateful heart as I caress your head and bestow upon you divine love. Give me your praise, and with your own words, tell me, my God, beloved Father, with all my being, I need you. I'm here because you called me, you shouted my name in desperation, and I'm here to give you comfort and provide the answer you've cried out for. You've trusted in me, and that pleases me. You've prayed and knelt to call upon my name in all the situations of your life, and that speaks volumes about you. 
Even though I already knew what you were going to ask before you opened your lips, I love that you pray to me because your words are like holy incense, a pleasing aroma that reaches my altar. It moves my heart that you have such solid and certain faith, and that you know well that I love you. If I want to help you, reassure your heart, for you will receive what you asked for. Neither you nor your family will suffer these kinds of problems again. I will give you wisdom, you will grow even more in intelligence. I will give you the gift of discernment to recognize the attacks of the enemy before they happen. Have faith, go out, and seek the blessing I have prepared for you. I will put the names of some people in your heart whom you need to call. Maybe you haven't seen or spoken to them in a long time, but I am sending them to you because through them, I will bless you. You will also be the answer to their prayers. That's how I am, my child, my blessings are for all who believe in me, seek me with a sincere heart. I am opening a door so great in your life that you will need to maintain your humility so that pride does not affect you in the future. Open your Bible, immerse yourself in my holy word, and your faith will become even stronger, and your confidence will be fortified. Come and listen to me every morning. Open your ears, treasure the things I tell you, and hold my promises dearly in your soul. That prayer you said on your knees holds great power. Keep praying this way because when you think you are touching the ground, in truth, with that beautiful attitude, you are touching the sky, and my hand will be caressing your head with my love. The whole heaven says Amen to your sincere prayer. Write 777 if you believe in this. Now come, my son or daughter, and continue your day with determination. My angels accompany you, my love guards you. I love you. Have faith, I have given you courage and dignity. Do not accept defeat, do not fear evil. You know that I am speaking to you right now unexpectedly. You, who thought that everything was lost, but here I have come to encourage you, to uphold your arms, to infuse hope into you, to straighten your steps, to tell you that you will win this battle against loneliness. You have fought tirelessly because you want to escape from that place of suffering and sorrow. You've cried so much that you no longer remember the reason for your tears. You only know that in your heart there is sadness, there is pain, an inexplicable wound. But today, I come to heal you. At the end of the day, you have recognized your need, and there is rejoicing in heaven. But your enemies are trembling right now because they know that their time is running out. In your heart, the brave and victorious champion has awakened. You have great worth, much value. Fear will no longer bend you. You will no longer endure the shouts or insults of that person who has mocked my presence and has not respected you as they should have. The violent have chosen their destiny and spurned this path. They have arrogantly rejected my guiding hand. They have strived to invent slander against you. Those who cause you trouble will be cast into a place where there is gnashing of teeth and burning flames. Now I want to place the crown of life upon your head. I want you to rise now, my champion, and fight for your family. Division in your home will cease, my Holy Spirit will reign in your house. Doors will open, new opportunities will come, and I will elevate you to a spiritual level where victory is achieved only with a pure heart filled with humility. In the supernatural realm, the proud are not welcome, nor are those who call themselves righteous and point fingers at others, exaggerating their mistakes while concealing their own sins. You have failed once, but it will not happen again. You have me, and if you truly give me your entire being, prioritize my holy word, consider me in each of your projects, I will bless you abundantly. I will grant you victory in all the battles you face. But come to me as you are, acknowledge your mistakes, tell me what you feel. Write 333 to claim it. Now is the moment for you to ask me and bring me your doubts. I will give you a faith and confidence that you didn't have before. 
No one will be able to defeat you in battle because you have given me your life, and with love and all my power, I can. Woe to those who dare to challenge you. If you are listening to me, engrave these lines in your soul, write them down, and learn them. This word is a lamp to your path, it illuminates your ways and guides you. If at any moment you feel lost, if one day you falter, I am willing to lift you up because I know you will take my intention to help you seriously, and you won't play with my love. Tell me, will you take advantage of my goodness? Will you let pride swell your head, or will you humiliate anyone? You will treat all people with respect. You will obey my commandments, stay away from sin, refrain from entertaining evil thoughts in your mind, and not deceive anyone. Your lips will not speak lies. And yet, I know that as long as you live on this earth, you will not be perfect. But your loyalty, perseverance, and effort are the pillars of your faith. Make a commitment with me today to fight until the end and to see yourself as a loved and valued person by your Heavenly Father. Use this value to help others, but above all, value yourself as well. Listen to this message three more times, and you will understand the powerful revelation that will transform your life and your future in a supernatural way. Listen and prepare to triumph. I love you, and I will always love you. What do I have to do to convince you? I know what I'll do, I'll take you by the hand and kiss your forehead. I will tell you once again how much I love you, but now in a way so different that you will feel it. You will perceive the holy aroma of this supernatural love. I am removing the worries you have now and immersing you in a beautiful, marvelous, eternal, holy, and healing emotion that will never leave you. When you open your eyes the next day, you will no longer be the same person. This beautiful emotion is called love, and if you haven't felt it before, get used to it because I am filling your heart with joy and life. I love you, this tender emotion will grow with each passing minute. Your tranquility will become greater every day. Your whole being is transforming. The world seeks peace and freedom. People want to be free from disappointments and never face loneliness. But every time I extend my hands to them, they run in the opposite direction and reject this powerful love that can transform their lives, giving them the courage and strength to pursue their dreams and renew their desires to live. I planted that feeling in them that tells them they are not on the right path. They have to return to me, to their home, and distance themselves from evil, immerse themselves in my word, and embrace my commandments. Out there in the world, there will be only anguish and suffering. Eternal peace, divine peace, and infinite happiness are here with me. I can tell you again, I love you. Write I love you, God and share this video with five people who trust in God. Today, I will put small and beautiful details on your path. Sharpen your senses. Feel, receive, and perceive. Experience again, treasure this sweet sensation of eternal love that envelopes you. This is something supernatural that transcends. It's simply seeing and hearing an inexplicable emotion that fills you, makes you feel like you're flying above the clouds, but also transforms you, eliminates what hinders you. My power is manifesting not only in your emotions and feelings, but in the most powerful miracle, your change of character and attitude. You will no longer be a tree without fruit, a flower without fragrance, rivers without water. You will no longer experience mood swings or life making mistake after mistake. My glory surrounds you, and while it comforts you, it also gives you wisdom. Do your part and come with faith. Immerse yourself in my word, open your Bible and read it every day. Do it again, do not be discouraged, do not stop, insist, persist. This is the real miracle I want to perform, to give you peace, to have you receive my love, 
to enter anguish, to make you feel good, to enjoy my presence, not to experience loneliness, for words and phrases that build and heal to flow from your mind and lips, for your gaze to shine with love and patience, for you to treat your family admirably. A miracle without results is like a glass without water, a plate without food, a night without sleep. I never perform supernatural acts to impress anyone. Many proclaim miracles that seem real and powerful, but their lives and words communicate confusion, hatred, total emptiness. Those who do not love do not know me, because I am love. Don't worry, I will help you forgive, forget, have patience, receive and give opportunities to others, not allow anyone to belittle you, grant everyone the value and place they deserve. I warn you that some around you do not understand this divine love. Their hearts have grown cold. They say they believe in me, but they have lost faith in my power to perform miracles. Don't be troubled if they don't want to believe. Leave them trapped in their world where they alone are perfect, pointing fingers and claiming to know me, but offending me with their behavior. I will speak to their lives. Continue on your path, keep praying, loving, doing good without looking at who it is to whom you are kind. And if they offend you, forgive once more. And if you can't forgive, kneel in my presence, I will give you strength. My Holy Spirit will come upon you and fill you with patience and understanding. You already have victory in all your battles, just come and claim it with faith and prayer, with your hands extended. I want to bestow my powerful blessing upon your life. I will continue to show you my love in many ways. While you live in this world, you are in my presence. Your family is important to me, both on earth and in heaven. My power will manifest in thousands of families that receive this word. They will be restored and greatly blessed. Every home that loves me will be illuminated by my divine presence. To you, who are listening to my words, I want to bless you and bring freedom and peace to your life. From this moment, I am granting the requests of your heart. I will remove from your path those who wish to harm you, support your efforts, and help you realize your dreams. It is my will that you and your family live in blessing, health, and abundance for the rest of your lives. Trials come and go, enemies will try to divert you from the path, attempt to knock you down, defeated and discouraged. They want to see you fallen, but do not let them succeed. Write 555 to receive it. But your victory and your blessing, no one can stop them. I know you have problems, but you also have my promise that you will overcome if you believe in my word. Treat those you love with kindness and sensitivity. Observe their strengths and talents, all the good things they do. Speak words of encouragement to them. Give them the daily encouragement and enthusiasm they need. Also, value their differences, and even though some of your loved ones have different abilities, never belittle them. See everyone you love as I see them, each one has a special purpose. Even though they may struggle with bad habits and vices today, even though they may have serious conflicts, remember how you once were. I know your secrets and weaknesses, but despite that, I love you more each day, and I have never abandoned you. I haven't reproached your failures or come to remind you of your sins. Music, likewise, I want you to be this way with everyone. Many never thought you would reach where you are, but with my help and your desire to fight, change, and become better each day, you step by step reach the land of your prosperity. I also ask that you help those living under your roof, those you love and even those who are far away. Support, bless, pray for them, and encourage them to keep going and never give up. This was a special message, you know it's for you, and you have understood it, and I know you will obey me. Even though the world around you faces financial crises, conflicts, and rumors of war, you and your family will prosper. You will never give up, tell me, say that you won't, neither you nor your family. I love you, my power.
power covers you, my presence will always accompany you. Just pay attention to my voice while your eyes fill with tears for this clear and powerful word that makes your heart vibrate. Listen to me, do not ignore the noises that confuse your mind, causing you anxiety. I know what you feel, I know the loneliness and sadness. I know how much it hurts when those you love abandon you, forget you, and never return. I know you face the worst of despises, all because you gave yourself in love. It happened to me too, we love those around us with dedication and passion, but they see you differently, and they are not willing to lend a hand when you face death. You and I like to give our all, pour our lives into what we do, take the bread from our mouths and share it with those we love, give affection and tenderness generously. You've treated your family with love, but it seems they don't see or care about your sacrifice, your pain. I see your suffering, and for your anguish, I have a reward. Today, you will rise again, today, you will love life again, today, you will be born again, today, you will understand the greatness of my eternal love, my sincere affection. You will know how loved you are, and there will never be an enemy by your side that can separate you. Let go of the past, I want your hands free to receive the blessing that will soon knock on your door. It will lift you from sadness and take you to places where you can grow and prosper. You are blessed because your soul has cried. Write 999 to receive divine protection. I have been by your side and I will continue to be even in your moments of weakness and distance. I ask you to keep your faith no matter how small it may seem even when your emotions say otherwise. My spirit and my word assure you. Do not stop believing, do not fear humans. I am your helper, a brave person like you is not a coward. You are brave even in difficult times, you will walk through fire without being burned, you will cross turbulent currents without drowning. Do not be discouraged, I will be with you wherever you go, I will not leave you, I will not abandon you, I will not reject you. I am always ready to listen to you, understand you, forgive you, and bless you beyond your imagination. This is my eternal promise, my love is yours forever. I want you to feel my love, immerse yourself in the river of my spirit, feel full and satisfied with so much affection. I know you believe, you have shown me your faith every day when you wake up full of courage, because you know I love you, and I am with you. Amen. Write Amen to receive these blessings today. If you find our inspiring content, leave your positive comments. We appreciate your support by liking, sharing, and subscribing to our channel. Thank you for watching.